Happy Wednesday, everybody. Well, happy Wednesday. It's mail day today. Um, I ordered a box set a few months ago now, and it's arrived today, so I'm going to open it for you. So let's take a look, shall we? Here we go. Box put the knife in. And we, um, there we are. I like to say plenty of packing. Nothing worse than getting a parcel and it's damaged. And there we go. Just uh, turn the TV down. Cool. And what is it we have here? <coughs> Very well packed, in fact. It is the Blade Runner 2049 whiskey glass set. Um, I got it from Zabby. It's sold out now. Um, I believe, anyway. I haven't checked since I actually ordered it. But yeah, um, there we go. Um, the, the, the glasses actually look like a nice size, actually. Um, I can't remember the brand name, but the, the, the whiskey glasses, obviously, they're based on the glasses that you see in the original Blade Runner. Um, which people confuse with certain glass from Ikea which you can get for £2 which is a good tip if you're looking for something that's similar because the original glasses which you can still buy are very expensive um, but yeah they've got a logo on there which is nah, that's okay it's always a thing you get with these um, box sets if they come with like a replica of this weapon a, a weapon or a glass or for instance the um, Back to the Future series set that came out in Blu-ray, the German set came with a replica um, small DeLorean and it wasn't very good but yeah um, I mainly got it because it was 4k and because to be honest it was a decent price for the set so um, yeah you get the Blade one out, 24.9 4k Ultra HD, you get the blue, uh, the Blu-ray, you get the whiskey tumblers inspired by the film. So it's, it's it's inspired by the film. There you go. Yeah, looking at the picture there, they're not a great shape, but I said I can use them. They're just going to be on display, probably with the set. If anything, I'm looking forward to the special features, especially the design, the world of Blade Runner. And, and especially the prologues as well. So yeah, um, really pleased with that. Also, the other male thing was this, the Hurricane Fur Wizard. That's right. Saw this um, on various sponsored posts on Facebook one day. Thought that looks handy, so I went straight on Amazon and uh, picked one up. Let's. Uh, so, so hopefully, I'll do a little video for you later on when I return to you and um, see how good it is yeah so there we go I'll see you later on ladies and gentlemen bye for now and welcome back well um, it's been an eventful day really uh, you, you, you'll see in the obviously the beginning of this video that um, I did an unboxing of this the Blade Runner 2049 4k set with the whiskey glasses um, now, when I pre-ordered it, it was advertised on the Zabby site as having um, an extra disc with 30 minutes worth of footage, I presume featurettes and things like that, and five art cards. Well, um, it turns out that it doesn't come with that. It comes with the 4K release, it comes with the standard blue rear set uh, disc as well. And it comes with the two whiskey glasses and the usual, the standard um, features. And that is it. Um, I double checked my order and yeah, it's, um, it looks like it's a bit of a, a snafu from Zabby's description writing. So I got on to the... Um, live help on there which is to be fair very helpful indeed very quick very helpful 
and uh, they, they said they're going to investigate and contact with you within 72 hours maybe sooner so we will see what happens um, I, I can expect a few people I don't believe I was the only person who noticed so I can expect a few people being messaged in a day about it but um, yeah besides that it's still, it's still a lovely set there's nothing wrong with it and if they can't rectify the problem I'll still keep it to be fair it's 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 a nice set and I like the way it's it's boxed and everything and while the glasses aren't perfect replicas of the ones in the movies and I didn't expect them to be they're still fine um even if the they on a decal on this one isn't on straight um but yeah it's at the end of the day it's the movie you're gonna watch so yeah that was that was pretty can't really even say annoying because it was can't really even say it was annoying because it was it was just uh, with so many of the sets coming out you have you have the DVD set you have the blu-ray then you have the steel books and then you have that set and then I believe in Germany they have a set they have the a set that comes with a replica of the of Deckard's blaster and then you have what's the what is the blu-ray set with the five art cards and the extra disc now it looks like Xavi have mixed that up but it appears that that extra disc only comes with the limited edition blu-ray set and it doesn't look like it came with the 4k release so what is Xavi going to do to rectify it I don't know but we'll see I suppose um apart from that I did a few of the middle little modeling bits I I made another a light bee from Red Dwarf. Oh, well, I'm saying made it. I'm I'm still painting it. Um, I'm also making some Tardis windows for a one six scale Tardis model. Um, because they, the 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 windows on some of them are pebbled, have a pebbled glass effect. So I'm making those. Um, the pet brush, which is this thing here, was a is a resounding success. Absolutely brilliant. Our little tool. Um, and also came comes with a little pocket or bag version of it as well, which you just you just pop out like that and push on your own. So yeah, all in all, pretty good day. Um, we also had a rogue um, takeaway order, some funny. Some very funny person. Thought it was it was a great idea to bring a takeaway on our behalf and have it sent to our house. But obviously not paying for it, they just ring up and say, "Yes, I'd like a takeaway delivered to blah blah blah." A takeaway guy comes to your house and expects the money, but obviously I haven't ordered anything, so I had to tell him no, sorry that we didn't order it, and he was fine about it. But yeah, it's not the first time it's happened. But there we go. So yeah, um, um, till tomorrow. Bye for now.